really happy I could do it here at the Jude Italia and uh, more importantly I'm happy that uh, we could do it in the way we did, you know, the guys took control in a, in a quite horrid stage actually from, from beginning to the end and, uh, and they rolled out their skins, really rolled out their skins, they went longer than was what I thought was possible anyway, you know. Young Julian Remark was pulling about 5k at the end. Um, and Matteo Trentini normally goes at 800 meters. Had to go 2.5k, but the, the guys all day, like, they were incredible. Every single one of them did something special today, and uh, that, makes, that makes the win yeah, even more special. So. I knew the wind was coming from the left. Uh, we had to start the sprint on the left, though, so. Uh, because we caught the break, so I had to just drift, what, drift right and uh, to hopefully get the guys coming in the wind on the left. And uh, no, I was happy because you know, I didn't sense anybody at all. I didn't want to celebrate though because the conditions, you know. So uh, I just looked at one hand. Um, like I said earlier, more than the fact that you know we've won, I'm, I'm more proud of how we did it. You know, we've come under a lot of criticism this year as a team and in the sprints um, and we came here with really intentions of winning every sprint and we haven't just won every sprint, we've done it quite convincingly. We've we've uh, controlled the, the peloton from start to, to finish and uh, and the guys, whether they be experienced guys like Gert or or young guys like Lamott, you know, they just rode out of their skins, you know, every single rider from Bam Brambilla and Serge Powell's riding on the front to uh, to Golas and uh, and for Martin, the uh, Jerome Pinot riding to bring back a breakaway when it looks difficult to bring back when other teams don't want to do it, to uh, Matteo Trentin and uh, and Gay Stegman's really controlling the final. Like, really, could have been easy to get uh, carried away and uh, leave me alone too soon. They didn't do that today. They really rode with with their heads and uh, and more so they rode with the hearts, the whole team, and, uh, and that's what I asked for. And, uh, so that's what's made me proud this year, and more so than the actual wins. Well, I think with anybody, it doesn't matter what type of, of rider you are, um, you know, when it comes from, it's gone from the point when I first started of winning was a bonus, you know, to now being anything but a win is a loss, you know. That's a difficult thing to kind of, yeah, that's how things have changed. I know I no longer win races, I lose races, you know, and, uh, and that really changes not just my perception of things, but, but the team's perception of things, you know. You see the critique that they come under this year, and even I think some people made some, some shit comments about uh, the Saturday in Napoli when Gert had a mechanical and they said that it didn't work perfect when in fact it was quite a perfect stage for the team you know <coughs> cycling news but uh um no it's that that's how it is now you know and uh, that's probably the thing that changes your mentality most when when you don't win you lose now and that's part and parcel of it it shows you're doing something right and uh quite happy it's better to be in that position than, than a position where you're at least less successful